final piece of emotion, and really the, the last of these sort of basic elements of a good argument, is are you appealing to the other person's needs? And what that means is, again, are you really thinking about the other side? Are you making sure that uh, what you're talking about actually has something to do with them? So one example, again, if we're talking about Bob, is if I'm talking to the teacher and I don't want to be in trouble, one, I will acknowledge their viewpoint by saying, hey, yes, you're right, I was out of my seat. But on top of that, if I'm appealing to the other person's needs, maybe I know, hey, I know it's important to you to have a classroom where people aren't wandering around. Right Now here's how I can address that for you, and here's either how I was trying to help or how uh, I will help in the future. Right? Again, if you're trying to help that other person out and you're being honest and acknowledging where they're coming from, again, they're going to be much more likely to hear you and move with you from there.